Bonjour à tous, hi everyone and welcome to Learn French with Vincent. This is Unité 1, Leçon M. So what are we going to discover together? We are going to discover together les jours et les mois. So the days and the month. Okay? Les jours et les mois. So let's see that together. And so we'll start with les jours de la semaine. Okay, semaine is week. Les jours, so you can see that it's the plural form. Huh? The days. Huh? Les jours of the la semaine. Les jours de la semaine, the days of the week. Okay, so we'll start with the first one. And in France... Uh, the week starts with lundi, Monday, lundi, lundi, okay, remember, UN is pronounced like un, lundi, 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 then mardi, mardi, so you can hear that you don't pronounce it that strongly, this R, huh? Mardi, mardi, okay? You don't need to go too deep like mardi, no, no, no. You don't move your tongue so it, does, it doesn't sound like mardi, no. It's really soft, mardi, 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 okay? The next one is mercredi, mercredi, Wednesday, mercredi, mercredi, okay? Next one, jeudi. Jeudi. Remember when you combine this E, U, you get the sound E. Jeudi. Jeudi. So I insist a little bit, so make it softer. Jeudi. Jeudi. Then E, N, nasal, and it's en, en. So remember, vendredi. 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 Okay? Then Samedi, samedi, don't insist on the E, uh, samedi, samedi, all right. And the last one, dimanche, dimanche, you get the sh, 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 and then A, N, en, en, dimanche, okay, let's see them one more time. Lundi, mardi, mercredi, jeudi. Vendredi, samedi, dimanche. Normally, in France, we tend to use this le weekend. So if we're talking about the weekend, okay, but then pronounce it the French way. Weekend. Le weekend, okay. But then in uh, other uh, French-speaking uh, countries, they, they tend to use this la fin de semaine, la fin de semaine, okay. But then in most of the cases, if you talk with French people, it will be le weekend, le weekend. If you want to talk about les mois de l'année, okay, année, year, mois, month, okay, les mois de l'année. So we'll see now the first one, the first one, January. So it looks, well, it looks a bit the same. No, no, wow, no. But in a way, anyway, janvier. So that's the way to pronounce it. Janvier, a n en. Okay, and then ye, ye, ye. Janvier. Then comes février, février. Okay, remember when you have this accent aigu on the top of uh, then you pronounce it E, okay? There is a lesson regarding this topic, so uh, don't be afraid. And if you're not sure about that, well, try to practice it. Février, février, okay? Then Mars, okay? So in a way, it's an exception because normally final S is not pronounced in French, okay? We've got some exceptions, and this one is one of them. So, Mars, pronounce the final S, Mars, Mars, okay? Then, Avril, 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 nothing really tricky about this month, I mean, for the pronunciation, Avril, okay? Here, be careful because people tend to try to pronounce it, to, to pronounce it the, 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 the English way. In French, remember, when you combine this A and then E vowels, you get the sound E, 
a so really open a okay and then you pronounce it me me okay so don't pronounce e uh, in, don't try to pronounce it no it's me me so it's not my it's me okay and then here well it's a bit tricky but still e n goes like un un okay and then you get ju juin 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 okay let's see them one more time janvier février mars avril mai juin okay second round hop juillet okay you get this double L here, ye, 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 ye. juillet, juillet. Don't pronounce this final T, E, T here at the end. E, juillet, juillet. So it's July. And then here, two options because, uh, well, two options are acceptable in French. The first one, you don't pronounce the final T. Ou, ou, ou. Second one, you pronounce it. Oot. 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 All right. So remember, first option, don't pronounce it. Oo. 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 Second option, you pronounce it. Oot. 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 Okay. Then, well, it's, it's quite simple normally for uh, English speaking persons, or then. It's quite close to uh, other uh, languages as well. So, septembre, septembre, septembre. Remember this E-M, en, septembre, br, br. You don't insist on the final E. Septembre, septembre. Then, same thing here. Don't insist on the final E. Octobre, octobre, octobre. Novembre, 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 okay, E-M, en, en, novembre, novembre, and the last one, décembre, 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 same thing, E-M, en, décembre, okay, so let's repeat them, juillet, remember this, ye, ye, ye. juillet, ou, first option, août, second option, Septembre, octobre, novembre, décembre. Okay? The little gift. L'hiver, l'hiver, and it means winter. So I've been putting this M here just to tell you that it's masculine. L'hiver, le printemps. Le printemps, spring, l'été, l'été, summer. So I forgot to put it, but here I should put M because it's masculine. L'été, l'automne, l'automne. And same thing here, it should be M, automne, masculine, l'automne. Okay, so let's repeat it. L'hiver. Le printemps, l'été, l'automne. And then, the last thing for this lesson, if you want to introduce the, the dates, okay, so if you want to tell what day it is uh, today, so, aujourd'hui means today. Aujourd'hui, today. Nous sommes, so we use the verb to be, okay, we are, nous sommes, Le 8 juin 2012. Okay, so forget for the <laughs> 2012, don't be afraid. We'll see that a bit later for the numbers. Okay, aujourd'hui, today, nous sommes, we are, le, you put the article, definite article, okay, and then you put the, the date here. Okay, you start with the, the number, the month, and then the year. Okay, or then, second option, aujourd'hui, so it doesn't change, it's here, today. C'est, it is, this is, and then you put the date, le 8 juin 2012. Okay? That's it. 
This is leçon M. It does mean that the next one is leçon N. And you can find it at the following address here. Or then you can go as well at this address, imagier.net, just to find more material. Have a great day. Bye bye.